Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, saya Cikgu Fazli Bayu Sensei. Jangan lupa subscribe channel saya. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, welcome back to my class. Uh, I hope all of you uh, will be fine. Okay, today we will continue with the lesson for subtopic 2.1. Uh, our learning outcomes for today is to describe briefly the mechanism of locomotion in an animals. Uh, firstly, we will start with the locomotion uh, in an earthworm. Okay, uh, earthworm have a hydrostatic skeleton. As we know, uh, all organism need to move, and to create a movement, they need a muscle they need muscles okay and then the muscle work in antagonistic okay so in and a world uh, they have antagonistic muscle which is circular muscle and longitudinal muscles okay circular and longitudinal muscle of the uh, body uh, will press against the fluid when it contracts and relax Okay, to create a pressure in the fluid to maintain the shape of the earthworm. The movement of the earthworm is brought about by the contraction and relaxation of the circular and longitudinal muscle alternating each other which is we call it as antagonistic. Okay, here the diagram uh, the cross section of an earthworm. Okay, the singular uh, the circular muscles in a round shape and the longitudinal muscle in long longitudinal shape when the worm move forward the circular muscles at the anterior end will contract the compressed fluid cause the relaxed longitudinal muscle to strengthen the segments extend and the body move forward following this extension movement the longitudinal muscle at the anterior end contract and the circular muscles relax and the body will shorten. Okay, this picture show the structure of an earthworm which is consists of a special structure we call it as keta. Okay, keta or seta. So this keta will help the Earthworm to anchor, okay, to anchor to the ground when it moves. Beginning from the anterior, the circular muscles contract, causing the anterior segment to become narrow and retracting the aketa and extending forward. The longitudinal muscle of the anterior contract, this segment now bulge and the keta protrude. To anchor the ground, it will anchor like this. With the anterior segments remaining stationary, the wave of contraction of the longitudinal muscle continues down the body, pulling the rear segment forward. 